Now, shoppers in Dudley have given their support to a campaign to have a stained glass memorial to Sir Winston Churchill put back on display in the town centre. The 17 glass panels were unveiled at the Churchill Shopping Precinct back in 1969, but were removed in the early 90s due to damage from vandals and the weather. Bob Hocknell has the details. The unveiling of a masterpiece, 17 stained glass panels celebrating Churchill's life. The memorial stood proud over Dudley's shoppers for more than 20 years. But because the precinct was open to the elements back then, it fell into disrepair and was removed. Beautiful. The sun used to come through it. It was lovely. It made the place bright. I was born in the war, but you know, my father fought. So it was lovely to that was there that we remember those times really. It should be somewhere. Um, it's part of our town, it's part of our heritage. The damaged memorial, designed by Edward Bainbridge Cotnell, has been hidden away in a cellar for 20 years. The town's MP is negotiating to get it restored to its former glory and then put back on display. I think it does say something about you know the people who were running Dudley in the 60s, the people who were running this shopping centre at the time, that they came up with the idea and, and got a world-renowned uh, artist to come to Dudley and produce what was an absolutely magnificent piece of public art. And I think we should have that same spirit today. The hope is to get the mosaic reinstated in time for the 50th anniversary of Churchill's death in 2015. Shopping centres these days are often accused of being bland and all looking the same. Supporters of the Churchill Memorial say it not only remembered a great historical figure, it also gave the shopping experience in Dudley a distinctive feel. The decision to remove the glass panels might not have been Dudley's finest hour and a restored memorial will mean a restored town in the eyes of many people. Bob Hockenall, BBC Midlands Today, Dudley. Blue sky there in Dudley and I was in Cheltenham this morning. The weather was beautiful, warm and sunny. But what's it going to be like?